Uh, welcome to Berlin, where I have a civil war with me. Uh, you guys started touring with uh, Gloryhammer yesterday from Hamburg, and now you are in Berlin. How did the tour start off for you guys? Oh, really good. Sold out show for the first night. Uh, all the, the uh, crew and the band and all the rest of the guys on the tour uh, with us are very cool, so we're looking forward to it. Uh, you yeah. want to say anything more? About that? Yeah, it's been amazing. I mean, yeah. sold out is pretty much perfect. <laughs> and the same tonight as well. Okay, and do you have any expectations for the battles ahead on this tour? Not really. Not really any expectations. We know we're going to play and uh, hopefully people will show up and watch us play. Yeah, so that's it. All right, then uh, how would you describe uh, Civil War's live gigs? And how important are live performances for you? Oh, yeah. yeah, it's uh, very important for us. Uh, there's a lot of energy and a lot of, uh, you know, uh, trying to get the crowd really uh, into it with us. And uh, uh, we're a live band, I believe, yeah. I would say. And uh, everybody puts, a, puts on a good show, I think. I've only been here for, you know, uh, a short time, but uh, I'm having a good time so far. And, yeah. uh, how about you? Yeah, I mean, that's, that? I mean, that's what it's all about. We're just five happy guys uh, like to play music together and especially live. And I think people see it when they see us on stage that we really enjoy it. So we really want to kick ass. Cool. Uh, so, you introduced a new singer in the beginning of uh, last year, uh, Mr. Kelly Sundown Carpenter, right here with us. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So, um, how was the first year in uh, Civil War for you? Oh, yeah, it was uh, really great. Uh, um, uh, I think we uh, played our first show in uh, Malta, I think, yeah. yeah. And uh, it was really short notice, but we, we pulled it off uh, pretty well. Then after that, uh, we did a short tour uh, through uh, Europe uh, with our buddies Nightmare, and then uh, we did some uh, nice festivals during the summer. So we're uh, we're running like a pretty well-oiled machine by now, and uh, things are going good. Uh, I dig these guys, so it's a it's a happy, cool situation. So we're having a good time so far. Yeah, you know. Uh, okay, and uh, how was it uh, for the band to let the uh, NBJ go? Uh, I mean, he he went away himself. So, uh, but um, it was uh, we didn't have a singer uh, from one day to another, and then uh, we found Kelly Sundown here, and uh, we invited him to Sweden, and uh, it felt so great from the beginning he was like that we've been best buddies forever <laughs> it felt great uh, immediately so we knew it would be would be great and i mean this year has been absolutely amazing i mean we we're so calm and we're just hanging out and having a good time and there are no argues nothing we just enjoying spending time on stage and and here in the dress room on on the bus i mean we you we're like five brothers now it's great okay and uh, your last uh, latest album uh, the last full measure came out on uh, 2016 so when can we expect the new album to come out and what kind of music will we hear <laughs> we we're working on some new material um we have i think material for a half album maybe mm -hmm. uh, that really we really enjoy we but we we haven't recorded anything yet we just have the 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 basics but we have a really good feeling i don't know exactly how to describe mm -hmm. the songs but it's you can it's quite positive yeah. Yeah, you know, yeah it's a lot of it's upbeat. yeah it's 
it feels really good. Um, it's hard to describe, but it's a good vibe. It's uh, energetic and uh, cool. Yeah, and uh, we have no uh, no idea about a release date or anything like, uh, like that yet. We want to take our time and make sure we have a really good album to put out, and and uh, so uh, we'll take our time, but uh, we'll we'll let everybody know when when there is some kind of you know impending release date or something. But so far, we're just in the shop working. You know? Okay, that sounds good. Yeah. Uh, talking about the themes of the band, uh, of course, uh, war and uh, historical battles. Uh, where that, where does that uh, fascination for uh, war and uh, the battles come from? I mean, we come from Sabaton, so I mean, it felt kind of natural to continue the the war themes and. Uh, uh feel i mean it's feels better to sing about something that's real uh, that's happening around us instead of like dragons that doesn't exist nobody can relate to uh, so i think it's but I, I don't know the future about lyrics um we'll see what happens about that <laughs> we don't know we, we're just in the beginning of a new album so we'll see <laughs> so we are back with just uh, kelly and me because uh, soundcheck is uh, going on already uh so could you tell us a bit more about how did you join the band okay uh yeah um uh we uh, uh i found out that they had uh, uh lost their singer uh, it was uh, basically like the day after a, a tour had been announced for the band, and he came out on his Facebook page and just announced that he quits uh, the band. So they were in a big, uh, you know, a uh, tight spot. Uh, and then um, uh, they uh, they approached me and asked if I, I would like to, uh, you know, uh, give it a shot. And, and I uh, checked out some of the material, and I really liked the songs. I thought there were uh, great melodies and really good songs, and uh, and I thought that my voice would probably work for for that uh, style of music, and and the rest is history. Really, I just came out to uh, Sweden and uh, you know did a little uh, practice with the band, and, and and we were straight off to Malta for our first gig uh, about a week later or something like that. Uh, yeah, yeah, and it seems like the fans have accepted you. Also, uh, you you were very well received. So, how have you felt about the fan reception? Yeah, that was uh, really refreshing because I've uh, I've replaced uh, uh, you know other singers and and it hasn't been so you know uh, it hasn't been quite as easy as this. This was really almost a you know like a ninety ninety eight percent like you know full acceptance uh, from the get go. Uh, you know, I my first album I, report, I replaced uh, Jorn Land uh, in a band called Beyond Twilight, and there were people, you know, uh, on both sides of the fence, you know, uh, this and that. And I replaced uh, Apollo uh, uh, from uh, Firewind, and then those fans were, you know, like, you know, a lot of blowback and things like that. But for this, uh, for uh, Civil War, it's been almost 100% positive. So, thank you guys. <laughs> yeah, and uh, for last question, um, for this tour, the northest you are going to go is London. So uh, I know you might not have a you know precise answer, but when will we see civil war in Nordic countries? That's going to be uh, up to our label, but you know we want to come. You know, and we definitely want to go to to uh, uh, Finland. That's one of the metal meccas of uh, of all the world and uh so we're uh, kind of at the at the mercy of our label and wherever they find out uh, whatever they you know uh propose to us and and uh we basically do everything they uh they ask so uh i uh, hope they send us out there really soon because we want to come okay thank you very much and uh okay. have a blast tonight all right